Sorry. John Vitas bringing you back live to City of Palms Park in Fort Myers. We are in the ninth inning. And for the first time this season, FSW turns to their closer, Thomas Haggerty, who is in in a one-run game in the ninth. He replaces Ryan Gusto, who went four scoreless innings in relief and stands to be the winner. First pitch slider gets Borer swinging and missing for strike one. Gusto with four strikeouts, no walks, two hits, and 52 pitches over four. Slider. This time he froze him. Strike two. All right. This is the season debut for Haggerty. His FSW debut. A six foot six inch sophomore from Fort Lauderdale. The O2. Swing and a miss. Another swing and a miss on a slider. Christopher Borer is out number one in the ninth. It's the guy's right. Defensive changes to tell you about. Drake Dobianski, a freshman outfielder, has come in to replace Tommy Joseph. Dobianski is in center field, and Mikey Burke has moved from center field to right. First pitch to Alisea. A slider on the outside corner, strike one. Haggerty has thrown four sliders, and he's come up with four strikes. How'd he get it on the outside corner? First time in a purple Bucks jersey. Another slider, a check swing. He went around 0-2. Haggerty made 20 appearances for Coach Bezier last season, the most appearances of any pitcher on Broward College. That one just missed. Tried to extend the strike zone with another slider. and It's 1-2. and two. Haggerty struck out 36 batters in 28 innings. Only six walks and an ERA of 254. That one is outside. You can hear Haggerty grunting from up here, two and two. Why would he be grunting? So an even six to one strikeout to walk ratio, less than a hit per inning for the most used reliever for Coach Bezier last year. The two two. Swing and a miss. He spun another slider. Two straight strikeouts for Haggerty in the ninth. And now Miami Dade College is down to their final out. Both these teams came in 3-0. and Both these teams have played top competition. And the Bucks will only see tougher competition over the next three days. This would be a huge win for them going into four enormous contests. First pitch slider is in for a strike to Arias Ozone. Haggerty rocks and deals. Another one. Swing and a miss on a low slider. And now the Sharks are down to their final strike. It's been all sliders, 10 in a row from Haggerty. He's ready, the 0-2. Rolled out to second base, Marcano is there. He flips to Bagneski, and the Buccaneers are 4-0. Thomas Haggerty with a 1-2-3 ninth inning. His first save of the year. And FSW wins it with pitching and defense. That'll be the recipe in 2019. Santos, Gusto, Haggerty, a shutout, and a total of three hits allowed. It's a three-hit shutout with eight strikeouts and only one walk. All three pitchers in today's game for FSW pitched for Broward College last year. And Coach Bezier told us before the game that he has two framed scorecards in his office on his wall, games in which his Broward team beat Miami Dade, who was their arch rival. And in this game, he uses three pitchers who were at Broward last year and understand the magnitude of that rivalry. And they were fired up to face the Sharks. Again, Santos, Gusto, and Haggerty, Combined on a three-hit shutout. 